No, not from that far, right? It just sucks around from that far. Oh, wow. Okay, that's interesting. I did not know that. Yo, 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 what is good, YouTube? It's your boy Funk, and we are back with another video. And today we are Punk Reacts because we're going to be going back and watching some of the Topanga sets that we did miss today. We are going to be watching Fudo versus John Takauchi. You know, Fudo did end up winning Topanga, and John Takauchi is pretty much was like the rising star. You know, let's see what this match got to offer. Let's see who win. Let's see what type of tech these fellas got for each other. So, yeah, without further ado, I need you to go like, comment, subscribe, and turn the post notification bell on, and let's get into it. Cody versus Poison. This is a very hard matchup for Cody, too, so I'm actually curious to see how did John make this an interesting set, because this is hard. Wow. Okay. I guess that's something right there. Just a crash counter from full screen. Oh, my God. Surprised he just didn't waste a bar for the sign. Oh, he could have won there. Jab, jab, rough and soup. Oh, no, we could have rough. I mean, super there. So many missed opportunities for John. This could haunt you if you're fighting against poison. She could definitely get V trigger, which, oh, nice. Never mind. Oh, tried to whiff punish. Maybe he could have tried a jumping, actually. Maybe a jump would have worked there. Oh, wow. Really well spaced out. With all this great health, John's almost one hit away, but oh, that's it. No. Oh, nice. I thought he did the wrong combo. He could have killed with one bar, but take that comeback. That's a good comeback. Even if you got to waste all the bar. Oh, he tried to catch Fudo lacking, but he just walked forward and released the whip. Looked like they played before. I feel like that's not something you would just usually do. Walk forward, release the whip, and then John happened to sway. 2022 you know we have a new brand new look to the jersey and the jackets you know the jersey is a new lightweight mesh design to keep you, you know cool in the most intense sweaty sets that you be having at these tournaments and then we have this sick jacket that you see me wearing and it will keep you warm in those cold venues when your hands are shaking and trembling so go check it out right now I'm sure you will love these It's kind of hard for Fudo. You can't use Crouch Fierce. Oh, oh, he should have super those. If he Crouch Fierce, he will super it, I'm sure. So, you got to play without that. No, he got too thirsty. You should never do that there. That's an obvious neutral jump from Fudo. I mean, now Fudo is just laming him out. Nice whiff punish, though. Cody only really needs one chance. Combo, yep. Yes for game pretty much. That's stun. That does so much stun. Don't ask me why. You did though. So much damage. Oh my god. That is so much damage. Body. That's death. Yeah, that is death. 100%. Sheesh. I'm telling you. One mistake versus Cody. And then the stand light kick roughing for stun. That was probably the most optimal way to stun there, honestly. Nice whiff punish. Yeah, that button is way too easy to whiff punish. Fudo will always whiff punish that. And now just playing the matchup. How it should be played. The range game cannot get in. You see, Cody does have a lot of trouble getting in on poison. And that's why this matchup is so hard. You got an EX bingo, but she has two V reversals, so... Anti here and now she's back up and now all the way on the other side got free real estate every time poison anti here you people don't realize that all the real estate you get is going from her anti here the fact that she's a zoner with an anti here that just straight side switch is crazy so walking back with her don't really mean anything you want to confirm away oh there we go nice with funny you want to confirm away from taking it Okay, John getting back on the board somehow in that game when he was honestly looking really helpless. It was looking pretty bad for him. Good spacing on that roughing kick. Ooh, but a big crush counter on the sway. Fudo has been sniping that out all game. I think that's definitely something that's hurting John a lot. Oh, and he thought he was going to do V-break, but nope. Fudo again just 
just setting traps and John's taking them. There are parts of the match Fudo might do something and then he just immediately change it up and he's kind of baiting John into doing something. Which is not in John's favor because he is losing a set. So the more mind games Fudo can get in now, the harder it is later for John. Okay, you got the corner. You haven't really been getting the corner a lot lately. The first few games was really well dominated in the corner by John. He always stayed at the ranges to anti -air. Oh, nice. Oh, what a bad. What? He didn't have to activate there. Oh, wow. Chased him down. And the shimmy. Bro, look how fast Cody just... Your health. Oh, wow. Drop. But it doesn't really matter. It doesn't really change too much in the match. But it could help Fudo start to mount a comeback. Nope. You got a bingo, too. So, yeah. You got a guess here. Nice. Wow, and John just ties it up just like that. Maybe it's the side. I feel like John was getting watched when he was on the other side. Everyone loses on the player t when they get have to switch over to the player two side, huh? No, not from that far, right? It just sucks around from that far. Oh, wow. Okay, that's interesting. I did not know that. That is definitely some matchup knowledge. I'm surprised. I don't know how this matchup is 5-5, bro. Cody versus Poison is so bad, but John is playing this so good. His guesses on EX heart rate pressure. Oh, nice. His guesses have been so good on EX heart rate. Oh, finally. That might be the first one we've ever seen John get in neutral. Super? What? What? Oh, you did. Just super. I would have just did a meaty super. John bugging. That's super mad active. I would have just backdash meaty super. Not even risk trying to time a meaty. Okay. So, John needs, what, one more game to take the set? Oh, my God. Everything's working out now. Got the corner very early. Oh, he tried to confirm it, but Fudo got air reset it there. Oh, wow. What a counter hit conversion. No, that was sick. That was a sick combo. You don't see that every day. Oh, wow. And the walk up throw like my man ain't got the shank in his hand. Oh, yeah. Fudo's just slowing the pace down completely. Just getting all the chip damage. Not letting John get too many chances to just get an EX bingo out. To close the distance. Okay, here we go. Here's John. Oh, but he texts with a risky tech. Oh, and a good confirm went to super. Not going to kill, but this is pretty much over, I would say. He definitely slowed the momentum down a whole lot that last round, just zoning him out with the whip. And most times when John tried to get in the grab, Fudo was on it with the tech every time. So playing pretty annoying on defense. And very hard to get in on in neutral. So, John's going to have to try to get a good read. Oh, no. Right now, Fudo is running away with this. Nice cancel on the whip. Yeah, he's in such control right now. When you get a good read in this matchup with Poison, it's very hard for Cody. The matchup is so hard already. And the fact that John could even get six wins on Fudo's Poison is kind of crazy. Nice, he got the sand heavy kick comp. Ooh, a chase down on the V shift. We haven't seen that a lot from John, so seeing Fudo call that out, even though he's usually trying to be on the defense, is such a, it's just such good awareness and just not trying to let John Takuchi do anything for free. And he just went right back to the zone, but a good whiff punish from John. Oh, no. Oh, he didn't optimize the combo. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, the frame check. John had to confirm, but he didn't believe him. This set was amazing, bro. I don't even know what to say. They both played so good, so optimal. Really good defense shown from both players, honestly. 
But then I feel like Fudo started to see at the end, he kind of understood the hard raid patterns from John. And I think that's kind of what made the difference towards the end. You know, Fudo is just, he's just playing a great character and playing amazing with her. So, you know, what can you really say? So we are coming to the end of the video. So I would like to know what are your thoughts on this set? And if there's any more amazing sets from Topanga that you would like me to watch and go over, let me know in the comment section below and I will definitely check those out and see if there's something here that I've missed and is an exciting match and we can watch it. As always, I will see you next time.